Hello and welcome to a, another special video feature of one of our machines. We are excited today to be featuring the Burnett 79 Yaya Han Special Edition, uh, long overdue because these actually came in um, over the summer and uh, it's just now getting its feature. But what I wanna go over with you today is uh, who this machine is right for and a couple of the things that we love about the Burnett 79 and then specifics to love about the special edition. Uh, this is a sewing and embroidery machine. We've already done some videos on what makes the embroidery on the Burnett's special, so we're not gonna be any, doing any demo embroidery today, but I will direct you to our previous videos on the Burnett 70 that uh, did a little special on some of the cool embroidery features. We'll talk about a few of them later. Um, but to start, let's just talk about kind of who this machine is aimed at and what makes it really cool. So the Burnett line in general is really good at putting high value features onto their machines. It's true of their sergers and it's true of their sewing machines. So what am I talking about? Well, when people go to buy a new machine, primarily you know, the features they're looking to get on their new upgrade is more space and more convenience features, more customization features. And this has all of that. It is a relatively large space. It's nine inches of throat space. Um, so more room for putting bigger projects if you want to quilt, top stitch, etc. cetera, um, more space there. It has the cut function. It's got a lock stitch function. Those are more and more becoming uh, just can't live without them features on sewing machines today. And so it will cut your thread for you. It has automatic tension. So it's controlling the sort of precise tension that it thinks is correct for um, each particular stitch. Each stitch it has been optimized and has its own tension number on screen. Um, and then uh, when you want to reset it, if you have messed with that tension value, which is very easy to do, you've changed it for a particular project, you're worried about going back to normal, it's as easy as tapping a number to reset. And so it's very, very easy to reset once you've made a change, which is one thing that a lot of people uh, get very nervous about. Um, so those in general are gonna be appealing to a lot of people. Those are sort of broad appeal items. Specific appeal items, perhaps for uh, the garment sewers out there, people who are gonna be sewing on maybe funky fabrics, stretchy fabrics, uh, fluffy fabrics, stuff like that. One really cool feature on the Burnett 79 and the Burnett 77 is the dual feed that engages in back. So at the back of the foot, this foot itself has a cutout for dual feed, and it is a permanent walking foot that installs into that gap I just showed you. And now when this foot is, the normal foot is hopping up and down as your fabric advances, the other uh, dual feed foot is gonna walk in counterpoint. And so just like a walking foot, it makes it so there's always something on your fabric pulling it along. Really helps with weird fabrics, fluffy fabrics like this one. Normally, uh, this is gonna have a little bit of trouble feeding through. A couple things we can do about that. We can decrease our presser foot pressure and that's something that's also available on the screen here. But that dual feed foot is really gonna help. It does a lock stitch to start, that's programmable. You can tell it to lock stitch at the beginning and the end. And then you can see how nice this is feeding along with that little walking foot in back. Helping to pull the fabric. And then when I'm done, I can sew a lock stitch. And then I can cut my threads. Like I said, more and more of us cannot live without those features. We get this really nice stitch that's locked on both ends. So that dual feed is probably the number one reason that uh, this machine is sort of targeted at garment sewers, people who are gonna do fussier fabrics to sew. But if you like to quilt, um, if you, you know, top stitch with straight lines, modern quilting, that's great. That's a built-in walking foot for, you know, batting and backing and such like that. 
Um, so those are just a few of the things that we love about the Burnett 79 in general. Um, you might have noticed when I stopped sewing there, it, it raised the foot for me. This is another thing that lots of people want on their new machine is there's a pivot feature. It's raising the foot very slightly so that I can turn my fabric, turn corners. If you applique around curves, that's super duper helpful. And it's a real fast, you know, I'm always in a hurry. And so I want it to raise real fast. As soon as it, that needle goes down, that foot comes up. You can turn that off if that annoys you. Berninas are super customizable. That's one of the things that we love about them in general. Burnettes, Berninas, this Burnett is really, really similar to a Bernina. Um, it shares the software. And so just in general, both of those brands are gonna be super customizable. If you have particular stitch settings that you like, um, let's say, you know, you always sew your straight stitch at 2.2, not 2.5. Well, every time I go to that straight stitch, I want it on my custom setting. I can save that. It's got a little, um, oh, pardon me. We're gonna go down to heart and we're gonna save it as a custom stitch. And then whenever I want to use my custom straight stitch, I just go down to heart and I can retrieve my custom straight stitch. It can have a custom tension, it can have a custom press or foot pressure, all of those things can be customized. So like I was saying, in general, that's why the Burnett 79, just special edition, non-special edition is really popular. Um, however, the Burnett 79 Yaya Han edition adds some extra value. Uh, it is purple. Purple's my favorite color. To me, that adds extra value. But even if you're totally ambivalent about purple, uh, you gotta love the gifts that come with it. So first of all, because the person, Yaya Han, who I was introduced to with this particular special edition, she is a cosplayer, which means that she dresses up as a fictional character, multiple fictional characters, and uh, attends conventions. And so that involves costume making. Um, here she is. And uh, this is sort of her uh, wish list of garment sewing feet that she wanted to include. The machine always comes with the basic set of feet. So here is, for instance, this is just the big bag of stuff that you get, special edition, not special edition. Um, you get a bunch of feet to get you going. But there's some specialty feet for garment sewing that she wanted to include. Um, and so this is going to be, I think it's six feet. And I actually have the list here. Oh, I'm sorry, eight feet. And it looks like it's an open-toed foot, invisible zipper foot, rolled hem foot, uh, gathering foot, non-stick foot for leather. So definitely for people sewing with wacky fabrics, vinyl, leather, um, elastic, invisible zippers, stuff like that, uh, all comes with it. So you're gonna be ready to go. Um, another thing it, it comes with is gonna take us into our embroidery discussion. Um, so on the embroidery side, which we can get to home embroidery, and it's gonna tell me to put my, like, this is again, geared towards not only people who are, know what they're doing, but also people who this is maybe one of your first machines, maybe it's your first embroidery machine, um, your first big fancy machine, lots of help built into this machine. And this is one of them is every time you swap between embroidery and sewing, it reminds you the changes you have to make. Put your embroidery unit on, put the embroidery basket in there, bobbin basket, put your straight stitch plate on, then it takes you to embroidery. The embroidery gift is really cool. It is an additional software and not just any software, version nine. Um, version nine is the professional grade embroidery software for editing, for digitizing. This comes with what's called Creator, which is um, like semi-professional is what I would call it. Uh, professional grade, which is the full version um, designer is about $2,000. This Creator version, if you were to just walk in and buy it, uh, any day of the week, about $1,000. So, I mean, it, this is a really high value gift. It's gonna give you more editing capabilities than are built into the machine, 
the machine actually has a lot of editing built in. And again, I've already done a video talking about that. I think it's really cool what this machine can do already with the built-in software. But for somebody looking to break into digitizing logos and maybe digitizing, you know, handwritten quilt labels, um, that is going to be more what this is for, more fonts for writing out quilt labels um, on the machine, extra editing capabilities. Um, that is who this is going to be geared toward. And it all goes onto your laptop or your desktop. Um, and then you transfer designs to the machine using a USB stick. So that is a really cool gift, really, again, high value gift. Okay, and then just to speak in broad terms about the embroidery offerings for this machine, uh, this is a really good sort of starter embroidery machine without being afraid that you're going to outgrow your embroidery machine. It is, like I said, kind of geared toward people who this might be their first embroidery machine. Lots of help built in, you know, built in manual that help as you transition from sewing to embroidery, helping you figure that stuff out. Um, but also gives you more room to grow so that you're not going to immediately outgrow this when you get really into embroidery. First of all, it's got a big hoop. Its maximum hoop size is six by 10. It comes with three hoops. So it comes with little guy, comes with medium guy. This is five by seven. And then it comes with the six by 10. And hoop size is like the number one reason people outgrow their embroidery machines is it's so easy to find a design you really like that's bigger than five by seven. Um, and so this is going to give you more time, more designs you can do uh, before you decide, oh my gosh, I, I got to go get another embroidery machine. We'll be here when that happens. Um, but this is going to keep that from happening for a while. And then uh, also, it's got a really nice set of built-in designs, a really nice set of built-in alphabets. Those are gonna be in other reasons that people outgrow their machines. So we've got more designs than normal, than the normal B79. This is a special edition feature that we've got all these folders down here as well. And these are gonna contain uh, other you know, additional folders. These are subcategories, and then those will have designs inside them. Um, and then we've got you know, a bunch of nice fonts for you to work with. Um, and then again, I'm just gonna refer you back to another video with my face in it, but uh, there is a lot of precision, built-in precision is the other reason people will upgrade their machine that'll grow out of a machine is uh, precision if you make a mistake, you know, if you your project gets jerked around in the hoop or actually comes unhooped, you have to rehoop it, thread breaks, correcting for things like that, alignment. There's a lot of cool precision built into this machine and I'll direct you to that other video for that. Um, but I can obviously wax on and on about why I like this machine. So to sum up, um, Good job sticking with me this far. But to sum up, this is a really good uh, starter machine for somebody looking to get into garment sewing or embroidery or just an upgrade machine if you are looking to get some of those you know, high ticket items like cutting your thread, locking your thread, that pivot feature where it raises the foot, the dual feed works really well on funky fabrics. Um, just in general, there's a lot to love about this machine and it's very easy to love. So uh, this will be around until it's gone. You know, the special editions are a kind of single release. So, you know, you get it until it's gone. Um, if you love that purple, you got to get in here. We look forward to seeing you come in, ask questions, call, ask questions. We love it when you guys interact with us on our videos. So uh, thanks for sticking with us to this one. And there is more cool new machines coming. Uh, just you wait.